Hello everyone, this is Jebro and welcome to another guide gameplay video. For this is going to be for my uh, engineer build where I am using bombs and celestial amulets but I am using a, a different set of sigils. I've not actually got an extra dodge sigil, I've actually chosen to go for the sigil of torment and I've gone for enhanced performance to gain that might back that we lost a while ago and uh, going with power shoes and whatnot as well. So protection is high up on this build and uh, backpack regenerator is great with the celestial extra healing there you get. Automated medical response as well. Health threshold is 25%. Uh, you will get another heal. So if you time that well enough, you can c get some quick mic sacking as well. So quite useful. I know it's 90 second cooldown, but still can help you and can build up some extra nice extra might as well. So we'll see how we do in this game. Um, got two Ellie's and probably two DPS guardians. Actually not a bad comp, but you can see that their comp is not very fun. So this is going to be interesting. We've got some bursty builds potentially. We might have an altruistic healing bunker. Not too sure. Everyone's happy with playing uh, the Guardian, Medi Guardian DPS burst builds. Hammer, um, Scepter Focus, or, ham or uh, Greatsword Scepter Focus at the moment. So... Especially in the unranked like solo queues, so we could see some nice bursty movement where on this map where I might get kind of screwed in different positions, uh, but we will see. Probably best place for me to go is going to be close actually at the moment. It's a very good one v one build. Unfortunately, this person isn't moving. Oh, phew! They are moving now. Okay, so let's see how we go. Let's get a little bit of extra speed up here, going into the cap. I'm going to try and commentate on everything I'm doing and the reason why I'm doing it. Oh, I've got two cross. We've got two cross. This is not going to end well for me. Uh-oh. Yeah, these guys are playing together. So we are going to use slick shoes and we are going to get the hell out of there. There is no point in trying to keep that cap. I might as well back up another point where I can actually be useful and not die. And we can get actual node here so they've got their trap up as well so we need to be careful there is someone oh, okay here's bunker guardian just knocked him back that was good uh oh this could be okay here we got the nice nut bomb there we go good job ah Jesus and the other guy came down even though I was down there didn't need to we got the uh, Necro in the Plague form. Someone's on the point. There's no point in me being there as well. Actually going to go back. Ah, oh, no, I'm not. We need to get a node here. Come on. We need to get this quick. If we can wipe them, that would actually be really, really, really useful. Try and knock the necro back in. He feared me down. That's fine because now I can use my now I can use my stun break because I definitely needed to use that. And I'm going to go for the decap over on the far points. We should have mid. We should have mid now, easily. Now they're going to get respawns and uh, people are going to need to come back me up because I'm probably going to get a few people coming towards me. Let's hold. I don't know. Maybe not. See how we go here. Necro. Oh, God. He's Condi as well. For once, really. Terramancer. So that was that was unavoidable, unfortunately. This is going to be horrible. Ah, what the hell? Knocking him back, trying to interrupt anything I possibly can. I'm going to pull him as well. Oh, there's so much damage. I'm going to get some mine up. Remember that um, field is up, so probably the best person to go for here is going to be the Guardian, because I just I want to avoid the Necro. I want to get some focus on him, but to be honest, I think the Guardian is just going to be easier to kill here. Here? Sounded like Canadian or something there, man. I got my blind up. Ah, didn't get it off in time. Now we're zerging a little bit, so I need to move out of here. Rest of the guys, uh, they probably did help me quite well there, but still, didn't need to leave that cap open. Don't 
Um, plus one fights too much. If you're going to plus one, if you like, move quickly, if someone dies, because basically there is no point. Now that guy made a mistake in leaving the cap open because that was going to be an easy recap for us. Looks like we're using quite a lot of the treb as well, which is not too bad. Jump shot's great to get across from the mid to and vice versa to the edge of the Oh He's got spill it up, that was a mistake. I did just see that, he got the res. Still gonna go for the Guardian. Focus him, I'm gonna pull him as well. Ah, I just got stability there as well, just as I was using it. Should have cancelled that. Would have been useful. Did waste it in the end. Trying to go for the uh, wrong guardian, uh, wrong person here. They've got a lot of sustain on this cap, and uh, there's probably not much point in me staying here, in all honesty, because that will be ours for a while. So I'm going to go and plus one somewhere else, so we can get the point quick, or get the decap at mid, which is probably going to be useful. There's definitely not someone here. Should be able to hold that fire over there, to be fair. They're both quite bunkery. you got Celestial Amulet. Ellie, he's going to go off point, avoid all that cleave that's happening. But it doesn't look like we're doing too well. Um, <laughs> okay. We're going to lose that, but we're going to get a free cap for a bit of time here. I'm going to go join that fight again. But you've got to be, you've got to be rotating so fast. Well, we got the free cap. That's how we came back. I'm going to try and use my net there. I'm going to CC. Oh, God. Block again. There we go. I'm just failing a little bit. <laughs> just a little bit. Didn't look at his... Um, didn't look at his bar there. He actually had stability. I'm just Hopefully I've run that at the right time. There we go. Easy. I'm actually going to use my speed to move to mid faster. Hopefully by the time I get to mid, he's not going to mobilize me and screw me over. So here we go. We're going to run into mid now. Da, 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 da. Pull him there. Ah, oh, I didn't dodge. Whoa, that knockback was Zopi, apparently. Uh oh, here we go. Oh, is it? What the? What? What are you doing? What are you doing? That's another good thing to do. Hello, I'm just going to damage you while you screw yourself up. Uh-oh. As soon as he comes out of that, I'm going to create him. I'm going to create him now. Slick shoes. CC. Oh, I dodged it. Got to be really careful here. No, don't get caught in that burst. From the. I'm going to pull the neck right. No. We need to go for the necro. <laughs> need to range off point now. Don't want to get screwed over here. That guy's running an interesting build. Oh, he should, I think he's playing bunker. We've got two bunkers here. It's weird. Or oh, might. He's probably going to use. Okay, he's not used stability. He got up though. Okay, I screwed up there. Hardcore. I'm going to use that as well to get some extra speed and actually drop a ton more. Six years. We're going to win this fight in the end, but it's taking a while. If you can get them off point so that it's not it's going to force him to actually come off node to do that. See, so there you go. We're going to get the decap at the very least now. Now the other guy's not applying much damage for a for a DPS to be fair. Knocking back there. Mm -mm 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 -mm. He's gonna come back on, but by the time he does that, I'm probably gonna get most of the node. Oh, unless I do that. But you're thinking, damn, this is against the flipping bunker. How boring. <laughs> come on, mate! You can do better than that. 
Now he's stay on the point. Stay on the point. God damn it. No, or oh, don't. Or oh, don't. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> you know? Some people, eh? We have got a bit of the lead at the moment. Don't want to be involved in that uh, blind field too much, although I did. Just going to gain some extra moment here because I need it because this guy is seriously winding me up now. <laughs> no, I don't need you here. I really don't need you here, man. Come on. Leave me alone. <laughs> You're a bunker guardian. I'm 1v1. I really want to tell him. I really want to tell him. Screw it. You know what's happening right here? I'm leaving because that is dumb. Come on. We're in a 2v1 2v situation. We've already killed a guy. We do not need a bunker guardian standing there. We need him at mid helping there or somewhere else. When you, Very important, guys, that you try and think about these kind of things because it's very useful to know, obviously. Still not got that cap. Come on. No, don't down him, just boot him off. <laughs> I'm going for the cap. How have we not got this node yet? <laughs> it's because there's a bunker guardian and a uh, celestial elementalist versus a bunker guardian. Which is probably the reason. We get a decap now. Looking good. Okay, so now this should be fine. If we get the bunker guardian here, just going to hold it against him. Not going to get that, I don't think. Doesn't look like it. Thank you, thank you. There we go. We've got two people. I'm going to stay on it. I'm going to stay on it. Ah, I pulled that one out, did you? Pulled that one out, did you, son? Oh, well, you want to iron it. 1v2. There's not much damage here, to be fair. So it should be okay. Be able to hold this for the game. I can interrupt your cast. <laughs> You're not in flashback on, nice. Oh, we should be able to get some nice damage here. I'm going to crate them both. Blind them both as well. See what I mean? I'm keeping two guys here with this build at the moment. They're in. This is a bad position for them to be in. In time, I'm not going to kill them. Probably not. No way. Because they're too supporty. But, you know, I... Well, actually, thinking about it. If I get enough might stacks, I could. <laughs> but the amount of AoE damage I've got here is just insane. And I could hold this. I should have... I wish I'd actually got onto the node. That would have been more useful. But this guy... This guy's just stopped. Oh, oh, I'm going to get the guardian. Oh, 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 no, what is he doing? Why has he just stopped? He's given up. Oh, your boo, you would, come on, that's sad. Oh. He's the one to go for. Don't go for the bloody bunker. I, I swear, I've had this all night, just people who were just, not focusing the right targets. God damn it. If you are getting starting to get a bit of damage on you, just bail away because he's starting to line a sight around here. So you see. No. Should be able to easily win this now at the moment and take him out. See, I sustained 1v2 for so long, that guy's just given up. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Kind of sucky. For his team. Now, if he'd actually gone elsewhere on the map, rather than staying there, or he, sh he should have stayed in the 1v1, the Bunker Guardian should have left. Because, uh, you know, the Bunker Guardian is going to be better in team fights, and... So the Ellie, obviously, but the Ellie is the one that can actually, you know, he could, there's a possibility he could kill me in the 1v1, whereas the bunker has no chance. It's just not going to happen. So successful game, really, in the end. Uh, I'll post this video 
Whether or not it's useful to you because I won in these bunker fights for a while, I don't know. But I'll post it. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And I will see you very soon. Good evening.